YouTube, what's the goddamn deal, man? It's the one and only Papji, and we are back with another video and another Vlogmas, man. I think this like Vlogmas day four. Anyway, I might even be counting on. I'm just gonna put it in the description that this is the Vlogmas video, and uh, yeah, we're gonna do it like that. And at this present time that I'm recording this video, we at 946 subscribers and counting, man. Let's fucking go. Man, listen. I appreciate all the love and support that y'all giving me. All the motivational stuff y'all been telling me to do, man. Just telling me to stay consistent and this and that. And, and hey, it's like YouTube, when you... <sighs> You like the videos. We not just saying it for our health or a part of our script, but it helps us grow. You know what I mean? When YouTube sees that our videos are getting a lot of likes, it goes into the algorithm, which basically means let's just say a random video pops up on the the uh, the home screen of YouTube. That means that video has got a lot of engagement. Y'all have liked it. Y'all have shared it. Y'all done comment on it, you know, y'all did all that. So YouTube was like, let me go ahead and boost up a little bit so it can reach the masses. So continue to like these videos, man. Continue to share, continue to subscribe, man. And I'm excited for a thousand. You know what I mean? I'm excited. Of course, I'm gonna do a, a giveaway. I'm gonna get to that next video. But in this video, it's goddamn story time, man. So if you're new to the channel, Please like this video. Welcome, subscribe to the channel. And another thing, my last video, like my social media's down there, it was doing like some some weird stuff. Like I will be playing, I am gonna be playing. Like it would like go down and pop back up, go down and pop back up. I don't know why I was doing that, but I think I got it figured out. So it won't be a distraction. I know a distraction y'all because it was distracting me. And y'all like, damn, I can't take it down right now. So anyway, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell and take y'all shot, man. Let's fucking go. Let's take y'all shot. And you know who else is wild? My mama. She was like, Can I just take an edible instead? I was like, Yo, I don't know what to do with your free time, but we take shots over here. But if that's what you want to do, take your shot, mama. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So anyway, no today Friday, just got the fade, me a dry fade, nothing crazy, growing my hair out. So I was driving past Walmart, you know what I mean? Oh, Walmart, the Walmart off Wheeling. And for all my Dallas folks, y'all know exactly which Walmart I'm talking about. The one at Oak Cliff. And I was like, damn, I'm almost got, I almost got arrested. At Walmart for stealing, bruh. For stealing. So, pick the store. Let's take it back all the way to 2011. You know what I mean? So, nine years ago. I was a senior in high school. And I think it was around this time. You know what I'm saying? December. November or December. It was cold. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, uh, my partner, I ain't going to say his name. We're going we gonna to call him, we're going to call him Lightbug. So you went to school with me, y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. The brightest dude in the class. So he hit me up. Well, he, came, he came to school one day with like hella snacks. You know what I mean? Like a plethora of snacks. And I was like, damn, bro, where you got that stuff from? He was like, stole it for a homework. And I was like, you did what? Like, I stole it from Walmart. I was like, all right. So, he was like, you want to come do it with me? I was like, no, no, no. So, uh, me, I was one of, like, one of the few scenes that had a car at school or whatever. So, he was like, man, take me to Walmart, man. I need, I need some stuff. I was like, bro, I'm not doing this with you. He was like, bro, just take me up there. You ain't got to get out of like that. So, I'm me, curious. I want to see how you do it. You know what I mean? So he go in first 
and I'm not trying to make stuff too obvious, so I'm just kind of like trailing and like I'm shopping, but I'm just walking him. When I walk in, watching him, man, this dude. Now this is before self checkout was the thing. Well, I think they was around, but I don't think they was at this Walmart. Hell no, they weren't at that Walmart. So this dude would, would just, you know what I mean? Get stuff. He'll get like honey buns, oatmeal pies, Gatorades, Powerades, and put them in the basket, right? And then he'll drive around, drive around the store. And he'll find an owl that they ain't got no camera. And then he'll get her back. You know what I'm saying? Put it all in there. And then just. And just walk straight out the stove. So I was like, hell no, nah, man. Hell no. Nah. But he was like, hey, I only do it like once a week. Or I, I kind of like spread it out so they don't be catching on to me. But little do they know, they already caught on to do it over there. So I was like, bro, if it's that easy and they they weren't even like checking for receipts, as long as you had like that bag, they were like, oh, he's straight. So next Friday come around, I'm like, bro, I need some stuff for Walmart. And then, you know, you know what I'm saying? As a senior, man, I had like pocket change, you know what I'm saying? But I didn't really have like no no real money. So I had like gas money, lunch money, all that. But the stuff I was trying to get, it cost, you know, I need, I need a pop's credit card, debit card, you know what I mean? And I already know he wasn't really like going for that shit. So he gonna be like, we need all that stuff for. So I'm like, I get it myself. So one Friday, I think we got out of school early. And I think we had like a game that day. So we got out of school early and we slide to Walmart, you know what I mean? So he was like, you go in first and then I go in, blah, blah, blah. So I'm like, bit. So I get my basket. Honey buns, uh, candy skills, whatever I wanted, put in the basket. But I ain't get, I ain't get too much though. I think I got like a bag, a bag and a half, two bags worth of stuff. So I go to the, uh, I go to the back of the store, like the little tour aisle, look up, see some cameras, put that stuff in that bag, and I said, Whew. I got good. And then just. I walk straight to the car and I got away. I was like, hell yeah, let's fucking go. Got my stuff further free. You know what I'm saying? So he go ahead and do his thing, this and that. And we like, bet, we lit. So the next Friday, that's when I got a little greedy. I got greedy. And this is where I kind of, you know, I got caught. You know what I'm saying? And I thought I was going, oh, I thought I was going to jail. I thought I was good. I thought, oh. Anyway, the next Friday, we do it again. So, like I said, I had got greedy. I had got all the snacks. I had got a movie. You know, you know, you know that, that big old crate of five dollar movies. I had got a movie. I took that. Well, I just took the. I ain't took the whole the whole case. I took the damn movie out and put it in my pocket or something. And I got like hella under all uh, the Walmart brand under all my shirts, compression. You know what I'm saying? Tights. And I was like, I had like three or four bags worth of stuff. So. Uh, I'm going to the back of the store, or whatever, and I put it in the, uh, I put my stuff in the bag, got out, got my stuff in the car, and I come back in. My dumb man came back into the store. So, cause I'm, I'm looking for a light, a light bulb. So I go find a light bulb, and I'm like, yo, let's get up out of here, man. And I turn around, and this this big white dude just talking. I was like, so he like, yeah, you, you come here, come with me. So he gets me and he gets like, bug. and there's a little room right there in the entrance, right, right next to, as soon as you come in Walmart, it's like a door. Man, he takes to that door. It's the police in there. And it's all the cameras in Walmart, they be. So he was like, he asked me, where's the stuff at? And I was like, I ain't got no stuff. He was like, yes, you do. I was like, no, I don't. He was like, I see you come in here, but we lost you tracking light bulb. I was like, well, I ain't got nothing. He was like, all right, stand right here. So he talking light bulb. They had been tracking light bulb for like three or four weeks now. So he was, they was already on his radar. So the police, the policeman looked at me. He was like, listen, man, I don't know what you got going on. 
put you have a bright future ahead of you. You know what I mean? This your this your first little little incident that you're doing. Stop it right now. You know what I'm saying? So he was like, call your daddy. Luckily, I had to call him, right? He didn't answer, right? So, I go outside, and my daddy is outside. Not for me. He just happened to be at Walmart. He was talking, okay, he was talking to somebody, and he see me. He's like, what's up, boy? I was like, nothing. Got in the car, drove off. So, the police officer let me go, man. He was like, man, just, just be cool. Stop, stop doing this, because if you do it again, you're going to jail. And that's just facts. I like, <laughs> say less. So they keep like they keep light bulb or whatever. And I don't know I don't know what happened to light bulb. I think he told him, but I don't remember, but he got away. He didn't get away. I don't know. All I know is I got away. But I was just so scared because I was in the parking lot. I walked in the car, I was like, oh, thank you, Lord. And then my dad was in the parking lot. Oh like damn. I'm thinking he knows what's what's going on. But he like, what's up, boy? What you doing up here? I was like, shit, nothing. I'm finna go home right now. I'm like I, I see you there. Man, got, got away, went home. I never stole again. <laughs> so, man, that was the craziest and scariest time of my little high school career life. I thought I was going to jail over some, over some, over some compression shorts and honey buns and stuff. So, yeah, man, I ain't never, uh, I ain't gonna say that. I ain't even gonna say that. But like I said, like what what y'all doing now with the with the with the self checkout? Man, that ain't, that ain't nothing, bro. We was walking straight out this shit. We ain't pay for nothing. You know what I mean? Y'all getting caught at the uh the self checkouts anyway. I mean I got caught too, but I ain't paid for nothing. So that shit is that on that. But you enjoy that story time. If you want more story times, like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below, take y'all shots, and we out, bruh.